The NDP have now released plans for the beer grants that they'll be doling out for Alberta breweries. This comes after the second change to beer taxes in the province in just eight months. The NDP changed from a graduated tax for breweries based on size, where breweries based outside of BC, Alberta and Saskatchewan were charged $1.25 per litre of production. This is because the three provinces have a deal under the New West Partnership Trade Agreement. But just a few weeks ago, the NDP changed the tax structure again. They're now charging all breweries outside of Alberta $1.25 per litre to bring their product into the province. And they did this to avoid more court proceedings with Steam Whistle, a brewery based in Ontario that claims that the tax is unfair to them. But the tax is also unconstitutional under Section 121 of the Constitution, which states that goods should be permitted freely interprovincially. Now, BC and Saskatchewan are claiming that they're being treated unfairly by the new rules and that it violates the New West Partnership Agreement. The NDP didn't extend the grant programs to their trade partners yesterday, and the details are pretty thin. The only thing that was really announced was that Alberta breweries that produce 300,000 hectoliters or less are eligible to apply for the grant and that the grants will cost you, the taxpayer, 20 million per year for the next 10 years, according to Minister of Agriculture and Forestry, O'Neill Carlier. And judging by what little information we have now, it suggests that the NDP are just making things up as they go along. Of course, Alberta breweries are happy with the hand up coming from the new policy and the playing field is leveled between breweries outside of Alberta, even if it's at a higher cost to them. The rules surrounding the grants are unclear, but what's certain is that the tax is unconstitutional and that the Alberta government are alienating their trade partners. Honestly, I'm not sure how they come up with this stuff because it just appears that they're continuing to dig themselves deeper into a hole that they're never going to be able to get out of. As of the time of the airing of this story, Joe Sisi, Minister of Finance, says that there are ongoing negotiations between Alberta and Saskatchewan. So far, there has been no official statement released from BC or Saskatchewan or any of the breweries operating out of those provinces. But I'll keep you updated as the story unfolds. For the Rebel.media, I'm Holly Nicholas. Thanks for watching. Click here to never miss a Rebel update. Want even more? The Rebel will click here to become a premium member.